Greetings to you all. Greetings everyone. Trust God we all are doing great and you all are doing just great. Right, I've come tonight. This is what I never wanted in my life or to even think of. But when I check and balance seeing the scripture side and see the worldly side, I said, okay, this is my right. Now, you guys can see that was on my post right there, or the post down there. I'm here tonight to talk about Osarodion Osaige, known as God's Saint Foundation. I want to use this opportunity to voice out my pains or my grievances to you all tonight. Most especially, I'm coming out because of my daughter. Because of all these insults that we don't even deserve. And I don't know where it's coming from. And I don't know why and what motivation is behind it. So I want to use this opportunity to come to you, Diana Saigen. Because this is the only way to come to you. To talk to you. I want to say this to you, and I want you to pass this information also to your maggots. I want you to let them know the truth and nothing but the truth. This has been going on for the past couple of months now. I can see how people have been poking me, poking me, how some have been calling me, asking me, Oh, why did you collect this boy? Why did you collect this son? Why did you collect his child? Why did you do this? Because he doesn't want relationship from you. Because he doesn't want this. Because so many people are gullible and sentimental. And above all, more lunatics who don't know their left from right. They believe everything that comes out from your mouth. Osaro, do you game? I want to say this to you. Please, in the name of God, the one true God, I owe you nothing. I never know you before. I've never seen you. I've never met you. I don't know nothing about you. I've never heard you anyway spoke or speak or talk or anything. I have never sincerely from my heart. But suddenly, on that, I don't know what I should call it, faithful day, I saw a Post of your children. You are reaching out, crying out for help for them, for school fees and all of that. So, oh, wow, these are so cute children. I'll go ahead and sponsor these children. I've been doing it, sadly. I've been doing it. Charity is in my DNA. It runs in my fiber of my body. It runs in my blood. I love charity work. Because I know where charity brought me out from. So I love doing charity. So whatever friendship or relationship I had with you. I want to say this. So that your friends. Your gullible maggots. I want them to hear this. Coming out from me. I don't have anything to do with you. I don't need anything from you relationship or any i don't need it from you you were once married like you said you said you're married to a younger person and your gullible who come and say you are too old that's why he doesn't want you okay i'm 65 years of age i'm 85 years of age like you guys are saying that's fine Dion Osaro, Dion Osage. if you cannot keep your marriage with your mouth do you think you can keep a friendship or relationship with me? It's not possible. You know, there are some people you don't know. When you then mix them, you don't you then find out who they really are. You shiver and say, God, why? But in this case, I will not say God why. I will only say, Father, I need to protect my own name. I have built my name for years. Families and friends have built their name. I don't want to go and bring stain to their cloth or clothing. You told me 
You brought up a business proposal. And it sounds really good. Very liquidating. And I said, oh, let's go for it. How much? You told me millions of money. And I said, okay, let's go for it. I decided. I went into it with you. But not knowing that you were going to scam me. But clever as I am. The day you took this money in complete, in full, you sworn with a Bible, remember? Did you remember? But now, you come out out there selling your maggots, your elements, like someone close to you normally say. Telling them otherwise, telling them me, I'm begging you, me. And you're telling them lies. The reason why I've come out to talk, there's as far you can push, 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 push people or say things. They will take it from you. But as just, they, 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 it, it will come to a, a time. There's limits in everything in this life. How dare you put my child out there? And your lunatics. Your maggots are cursing and effing and blaming. And those of you women who are coming to insult me, I pray tonight, everything they have written up there, all the insults John Osaro, John Osage has passed to me, has cost me in time of saying this money is for business. It will be your portion. But if not, so be it. Oh, he doesn't want to. That's why he took his. That's why he took this boy. That's why he took uh, 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 this one. That's why he took Osama Osama said, Listen to me, guys. I want you all to listen to me attentively. Tell Dion Osara, Dion Osage. So please, in the name of Jehovah, one true God, tell him to give me back my business money. But if he refuses to, and he says he doesn't want to pay, that's fine. I'm not asking him. He's the one poking me. He's the one sending his lunatics. He's the one sending his maggots to come and be poking me, poking me, poking me. And this time, I'm tired of talking about it. I don't want to talk about it. I've zipped for too long. Please, John, let them know. Because we don't want to open our dirty linen out there. Please. I beg you in the name of God. Pay me my money. But if you decide not to pay, that's fine. I let go. But I don't let go of the money. You will definitely pay me because the Bible says you will bless the works of our hand. So I work so hard for it. You will not like the other side of me. I am telling you in sweat, in the rain, in my menstruation, in the sun, I worked hard for every penny. So for those of you who are listening to me, it was a business money, a long sum of money, business. Please, for the sake of God the Father, one true God, let's not stain our dirty linen. And for those of you women who are easily Peacefully, comfortably, cursing children like you've just done there. Cursing child or children. Keep up with it. Keep up with it. Good job. Keep doing it. Keep doing it. The Bible says, whatsoever a man saw it, he will reap. Osaradion Osayim, like you said, no level.
pay me my business money. It was hard earned money. I don't want friendship. I don't want relationship. I don't want nothing from you or with you around you. I don't. I have integrity. I have a name to keep. And I'm going to keep it by his grace. Please. Let's keep our dirty linen inside. Pay me my monies. And you maggots, riffraffs, that come moving around, stop it. And go back to the drawing board. Tell him to tell you guys the truth. I don't want you. <laughs> it's even a shame and a shame. A massive shame to me to know that I was once someone who spoke to you or who sat down with you, who was with you as a friend. Call it whatever you want to call it. But I'll say this to you. Like you said, that church girl, you know, and you know if you do anything, you no know, girl level. I'm not a juju girl. I'm a church girl, like you said. Please give me my monies in full. I did not dash you. Only God knows. But pay me my money and go your way. And stop using me to say I took what belonged to you. I did not pay me my monies. And I will collect my monies in full. I, I, think, I don't think you expected I'm going to do this video. You women out there who wants to do businesses with Osarodi on Saigon, listen to this video. I'm a very peaceful person. I don't want quarrel. I don't want fight. For two years plus now, you've taken my own money and you're the one fighting me. And you're the one poking me. Give me my money. And I came out because of my child. Take him off your Facebook and take me off off your Facebook. I say this again. I say it once more. Take me off your Facebook. And thank you so much, all of you, for listening to this and for understanding. And those of you who will come and say, X, Y, Z, I pray tonight. Every pains and tears, everything that has happened to me concerning this money is or putting my child out there to insult, let it be your portion, unless you judge right in this. May the Lord bless you all, and keep you all, and make his face to shine upon you.